Oh, does Sharon want a battle? Oh man, who could have guessed? Who could have guessed? I, I just did a gym battle and now Sharon wants to battle me. Th this is a whole new... The, the pattern has been all... It's been flipped on its fucking head, folks! Never before have you seen such an instance in this game. Starts off with Unfez at level 33. I fought one of those earlier today. I know how to fight those. Uh, Supreme G, you're gonna die. <laughs> you're gonna die. I don't think we really need to... to lead seed this guy. And we've got two... we got two Smugs now, so let's go to Smug the Original. Let him, uh, have a, a crack at this Un Pheasant. Air Slash, more like Bear Fash. Yeah, that didn't do shit, because it's not very effective. Let's go for a super boosted magnet! Ah, uh, fuck your s fuck Let's go for a super boosted magnet natured mega awesome ultra chicken spark attack Almost we almost got and he's paralyzed. How do you like them? Paralysis, how do you like them? Probably not very much at all And we'll finish him off with a flame charge to get our speed up a little bit because why not if you can you should why not? Maybe oh <laughs> smug Smug, what are you doing? That's all you can manage. Maybe, uh, maybe Smug won't be good against the Ice Gym if that's all his Flame Charge does. Maybe I want to use somebody with a Stab bonus move. Although Spark, Spark should also be okay against the Ice Gym. So maybe I'm speaking too soon. You're done. Unfez instead, and I still have my boosted speed. We can, we can fight Semi Seer. Semi Seer will take an electric move as well as anything else. Go for it. How do you like these magnets in your face? Hey, did a little bit over half. It should be able to finish him off unless we're dead. Oh my god, Smug! Smug, you're taking the monkey's explosions really seriously over here. Finish him off? Oh shit, Smug, what happened? Not so smug now. I thought you would never lose. I thought Simi Seer sucked. How did Simi Seer do so much damage to us? Maybe Smug doesn't have the defensive capabilities that I once thought. Let's go for a uh, Sindarian Retaliate? No, why would I waste Retaliate on that? I guess it's too late now. I already made my, my choice. Finish him off? Yeah, he's gonna be faster. How much is that gonna do? Fuck! semi Seer and his Flame Burst is really strong! Bizarrely strong. Do what? Okay, do what? It's something I know how to take care of. We'll go to... We'll go to Don V for that one. And then we can Leech Seed his last thing if it's even worth it. Do what should not be taking a spark very easily. Go for it, Don V. You're faster. Your first time in battle, as far as I remember. I'm pretty sure, because we just got you. Revenge. Is that going to do a lot to poor little Don V, the painter? Uh, it, it did a fair amount. If it's not over half, it's not that big of a deal. You have a leftovers? How do you have a leftovers? They're not available yet. I want a leftovers, that's why I'm going through this stupid mountain. <laughs> okay, you're done. Lyopard, that's fine. We'll leech seed you just to guarantee our victory, because I like guarantees in life. You don't get very many of those, and I like to keep the ones that I can get. Supreme G, don't fuck us. Hit him with the seeds, and we're done. And we're done. We can just chill out, max out, relax, all cool and all. And other such monkey catchphrases that he stole from other th Oh no, not fake out! Ah, uh, okay. That's one way to get around Supreme G's prankster ability, but you didn't get around it hard enough, because now you're seated. Supreme G, good job. I'll, I'll see you later on. Hopefully your Focus Sash pays off when we eventually get it. Let's go for Victor's Retaliate, and if he dies, we'll finish you off with Sindarian's Retaliate. We're a... Oh, I, I should have uh, I should have taught Watchhog Retaliate. I forgot. I forgot I even put him on the team a minute ago. I should have used him to test his abilities in this fight. You know what? Let's give him his moment to shine. Let's see how Watchhog does. Even without a retaliate. He deserves a chance to fight. Let's go to Edwin MF. I guess we should just start calling him the motherfucker. I imagine that's what MF stands for. Go, motherfucker! Assurance not going to do anything to my motherfucker over here. I'm going to... I'm gonna say motherfucker so much, I'll sound like Psy doing a Let's Play, just saying fuck every other word. 
which is, uh, it's not really an inside joke, it's just an observation. And I don't know why I'm saying it, because very few people would get the reference. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? After you? Is that... Is after you the attack where I use their attack against them? Super Fang is the one that cuts their health in half. Hyper Fang is a super strong uh, normal move and Psych Up, I don't know. We should look and see what his moves are. I never actually did that. Would have helped if I taught him Retaliate and then looked at his moves then. But I was in too much of a hurry and we missed! But we'll suck him up and get another shot. Edwin, finish him off with a hyper... Oh, God. Uh... Super Fang him. I was gonna use after you, but... I thought Super Fang would be more fun. Yeah, it'll suck him up more, and then even if we miss again, Edwin, we'll suck him up with the seeds and it'll be all okay. Let's see if after you works. Okay, Assurance. Now, do we use Assurance right back on him? No, it, it failed. Whatever. Edwin, you didn't land any good attacks other than, I guess, a, a Super Fang when he was already low in health anyway. But we won! Sharon, you're done, son. It's over. Get out of here, etc. All the typical shit. I think Alder's gonna come bother us now when I just want to look at motherfuckers' um, move pool and see what they do. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, Surf! Good. That'll work great with all my water Pokémon that I have. Okay, after you, the user helps the target and makes it use its move right after the user? I have no idea what that means. I thought it was... It makes it use its move right... I thought it was one where I steal their attack, but I guess not. Psych up, the user hypnotizes itself into copying any stat change made by the target. That's... That's whatever. Let's replace after you, which I still don't know what that does, with retaliate. And with that, let's go heal up and then we will make our way through Twist Mountain. Okay, it still says spring, but let's see if it changes if I go inside and go back outside. Let's see if my master plan worked. Uh... Hey! There we go! Uh, everybody, it's now officially December 16th, but we're in the winter, baby. Which means we can go get Substitute and make sure that we never lose again. I took a look at the list of Pokemon available here on Twist Mountain, and I was not impressed. I think the highest level available was like, like Drill Burr level 31 or some shit, which is extraordinarily low. I don't think I'm going to catch anything in this cave. Unless... Unless there's something that I did not even notice that pops up. And like, if a Bulldore level 34 like this pops up, I'll probably catch it. But otherwise, I'm planning on just running through the cave, getting Substitute, and not really doing anything else. Because, like I said, there's nothing in the cave worth catching as far as I can tell. So the best part of going to Twist Mountain when it's winter time is that there's these huge piles of snow which make the mountain almost non-existent. Like, usually when, when it's a different season, you have to go through all these fucking twists and turns and through all these caves, but now, I can just walk straight to the bottom because there's a giant pile of snow. It's perfect. It's perfect. I, I need to find Substitute, though. And also, since I just demolished the path and now I can, like, free roam, sandbox wherever I want, I don't know how to get out of here, so... <laughs> maybe, maybe it's better to have a streamlined path. <laughs> but uh, we need to find we need to find substitute. Are you in here? Hey, there we go. Substitute, perfect. Let's throw it on to Supreme G and see what we can do. We should probably get rid of growth because the other option is getting rid of Mega Drain, which would make growth worthless anyway. So let's get rid of growth for substitute. Let's test this out on a trainer, see if it actually works. I've never done this sort of strategy before, so maybe it'll be a colossal failure, and using Substitute will not help me at all, but I have a good feeling that it's the ultimate stall strategy, especially when you're sucking them up with Leech Seed, and you're also very low in, in power. But then again, if I get off my Leech Seed and then he kills me in one hit, Substitute was, was worthless, so I don't know. I don't know, let's, uh, let's give it a shot. Maybe I want to use Substitute first, but I don't know how that would help. Okay, this will probably kill me. Okay. <laughs> Good first test, monkey. We did it. 
<laughs> I, I proved that it'll work. <laughs> this guy is actually kind of tough. We're, we're taking a beating. Hopefully we can get out of uh, the cave on the other side undead. Well, shit. Well. <laughs> okay. All I wanted to do was test one new move, and now my whole team is gonna die. Uh, I, I, we, we've had a better showing, I think, in the past. This isn't our brightest moment. Oh, he's got... He's got super boosted rain dance, muddy water. Oh, Cynodarian, finish him off. I know you can do it with retaliate power. Hey, he did it. He did it. Can Cyndarian... Oh, he's got another fucking Pokemon. Oh, how are we supposed to fight a steel type with this shit? Oh my god, it's the big one, too. Hey, flame charge. I forgot I have that. Let's just flame charge him to death, even though we're in the rain, so it probably got... Lowered in power. Yeah, it looks like it. Great. Alright, that didn't go exactly according to plan. Uh, hopefully, I don't have to go all the way back to the Pokemon Center, because that would, ooh, be gay as hell. What is this? Oh, it's a fucking drill burr, isn't it? Oh, just give me an Excadrill at this point. I don't need a level 29 drill burr. Maybe Supreme G is too frail to use Substitute. Maybe the strategy is supposed to be... Teaching substitute to other things. Did I misunderstand what people were telling me when they said use lead seed and substitute? Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe I'm supposed to use it on other things. Uh, who else wants to do it? I mean, everybody can, but who wants to? Smug? You got any moves worth losing? And stomp is just a non-stab version of spark, so I guess I'll get rid of stomp. Well, I think this spells the end of me not dying. I don't know if I can beat level 35 Excadrill with two electric Pokemon. Let's try Stomp. Wait, no, he's part steel, isn't he? I should have used Flame Charge. Hey, he flinched. Perfect. It, it was all part of the plan. Go for Flame Charge. Let's see if we can do a third, maybe? Yeah, that was probably a third or more. Hone Claws, is that going to speed him up or increase his accuracy? Okay, accuracy and attack, but I think we're so fast we should knock him out! Either this turn or next. Hey, so close! So close, but yeah, but if he... Well, let's not stab, or that's not... Yeah, let's not stab and it's not super effective, so yeah, fuck you, you're done. Get out of here! Oh, I guess I could fight the doctor and then he can heal up my party. I might as well do that since I have no idea where to go. I'm still lost. Having the snow here was actually the worst possible option for me. Oh, Don V. Musharna, come on. Make it easy for me. I've only got two guys left. I need, I need this win. Let's go for a tract. Not much he can do if he's in love. Ah, oh, fuck you! Okay, Smug, it's down to you. Either you win and the whole team is healed up, or you lose! And we're, we're just completely fucked and we have to come all the way back. Go for a lucky spark attack? Knock him out? Maybe? Hopefully? Well, you paralyzed him, that's not bad. Oh, but he paralyzed us right back! Bullshit! But he used Defense Curl, so I think we're good. We're still faster, he's done. As long as we're not paralyzed. <gasps> Fucking Hyper Potion! Absurdity, my friend! Absurdity! But I guess at least now I get to use a potion too. Which I, I really need it! Fuck! This is probably the first time I've used a potion against just a normal trainer before. At least in this game. He's got two defense curls now, which is not good for me. Maybe we should try substitute and hope that he doesn't have any attacks that are strong enough to break it. Is he gonna break it? I don't know. This is probably a mistake. I'm not... I'm not really much of a substitute user. I've never used it <laughs> in my life. 
I know that it's really good competitively, evidently, but I've never known how or why to use it effectively. It's not really my thing. Well, that's not doing very much, but he's still paralyzed, so we should be good. We should be able to keep hitting him and heal back up. Now, let's see if it breaks the substitute. Oh. I guess, it, yeah, so that means it did plenty of damage. But hopefully it did more than what I did to myself and the substitute was worth it. I think that's the point. And also you can't get, like, paralyzed and shit. But obviously we're past that point. And I'm, I'm super paralyzed and he's hitting me again. Smug, you're gonna fail. Oh, fuck! Ah, fuck! Should have used a better potion than super potion, but what am I gonna waste? Am I gonna waste a, a max heal everything potion on a f fucking a doc fighting a doctor on on Twist Mountain? I don't think so. I don't think so. Well, here we go. All right. Maybe I should uh, turn off the snow so then it's easier to find my way through the mountain. I think I'll do that. Okay, Supreme G, let's try the substitute strategy again. And hopefully Thoreau won't kill us in one hit like he just did to MF. Okay, nice try. <laughs> Valiant effort. I, I don't know why I thought this would work. In what world am I going to use Leech Seed, get hit, and then still have enough HP left to use Substitute? What? What is the strategy? Why was I so confident? And why did people tell me it would work? I don't know. But now that he's seated, I guess I can use Substitute on Smug and try that out, so let's go for that. But then he just hits you with, with Revenge and the Substitute goes away. But then I guess if I suck up his health, I can use Substitute again. And I can just keep using it over and over again to stall, but eventually I'm gonna run out of health, ain't I? I mean, I'm not. He I mean, I I'm healing up quite a bit, actually. Maybe this will work. It's just like a really long way of stalling. But I don't know. It seems like I'm going down more than the enemy is. What I really need to do is get protect. If I had substitute and protect, that'd be good. But I don't think I can get protect until after the Elite Four. I think that might be true. I think I looked that up before. So maybe the strategy sucks dick without Protect, in addition. Oh, I think we finally made it to the end. Do we have to fight Plasma with my, what, two and a half remaining Pokemon? Or do we get a go? Oh, here they come. Oh, they're leaving. They're gonna go to the, the Dragon Spiral Tower, I think. Which, maybe I'll catch something at the dragon. No, no, I won't. Because I'm going up against the ice gym. So why would I want a dragon Pokemon whose level will not be high enough to continue using him into future gyms? Fuck it. Oh, we're out! We finally made it! Cedric, the entertainer, get out of my face. Okay, no more of that stupid twist mountain. Let's heal up. And maybe I'll go catch, like, a Palpitoad or something. There's got to be some good Pokemon in the upcoming route. Because I shouldn't be using anything in the in the 20s anymore. I got to upgrade to, like, level 35 and shit.